Our camera's on one man, scoring freely in recent games. Can anyone slow him down? The action is next on EA TV. And a warm welcome from one of the newer venues here in the football mad capital of England. We're at the London Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's West Ham United facing Manchester City. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Pablo Fornals plays with Jared Bowen out wide, and the striker today is Mikel Antonio. Real chance. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And once he gets onto it, there's only going to be one outcome. It's a lovely goal. One nil then. Number nine, Erling Haaland. Paqueta. Promising looking attack from West Ham. And out for a throw in. Just misfiring with the pass. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Who can they pick out? Not all that convincing defensively. Ogbonna. And made sure the pass wasn't troublesome. Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne. Holland. And now with Kovacic. And there the move ends for now. Downs. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Kovacic, it has to be, and there it is, but hang on, the flag has gone up, and it's not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you. Not to like about that pass, and very deftly cut out. City coming away with it and showing fine vision and quick thinking defensively Rodri delightful pass Holland so a corner to City as they try to increase their advantage. Well, it was never really going to be of concern to the keeper, that one. A wilting under the pressure, and now they try to go forward. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Johnson. Downs. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Well, as you can see, City have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Flynn Downs. 
the ball with Rodri. Rodri takes it on. And how about that for a save? Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Well, it was a poor attempt, and a goal kick it is. And Bernardo Silva has it. Now well, he's been ruled offside. Oh, he's given the ball away. And teammates around him. Oh, genuine chance. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Playing it in. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Cuts it back. Blocking it. Erling Haaland. Well, it looked as though he was going to net another one, but the keeper getting in the way. Well, that was a decent chance for his second there. Not the finish he was really looking for. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Let's see about the delivery. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box. And then what a finish by Haaland. He just seems to have a great understanding of where to place himself in the box. That's a brilliant goal. Two nil now and back underway. Given away by City. And he could really get at the opposition, but really sticking to the task defensively. Foden. Well, had that gone in, surely that would have been game over. Credit to the keeper, though. That was a good save. Just the clearance that was called for. Perfect tackle. Antonio. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Kevin De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Ake. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Foden. De Bruyne now. Oh, good-looking run. Can they convert? Oh, tremendous save! Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent piece of goalkeeping. That's a great stop. Corner for Manchester City. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And that will be all for the first half as the referee blows his whistle and it's Manchester City on top, Stuart. Well, we talked about their scoring record at the start of the game. And off and running again, it really was spellbinding what we saw from City in the first half. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. Is it going to be? And danger still. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, they're almost inviting them to come at them. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And a no-nonsense clearance. Oh, fancy footwork. And that's really well read. 
Right, news coming through of a goal in the Spurs game, and Alex Scott will tell us about it. It's a second goal for Sheffield United. They're ahead by two now, with 49 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Kovacic. He's in here. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, but in the end, it's far too easy to create the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. Antonio. Went in strongly, decisively. De Bruyne. De Bruyne! Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Oh, disappointing clearance. Magnificent defending. Rodri. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Trying to pick out a teammate. And miles off target with the header, but in fairness, the marking was tight. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's West Ham United taking on Liverpool. Foden. De Bruyne. A smart stop here. A oh, strong hand on the ball. Well, another wonderful save to add to his portfolio. Well, those stats tell the story. City have been really good today. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch here. And he could be in proper trouble here. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Walker. The ball with Rodri. And intercepted it. Right, a goal update to bring you from the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. That means we join Alex. It's a goal for Spurs. They're now behind by one with 66 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Significant acreage for City to run into. Well, there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Flynn Downs. Now with Paqueta. Return to Paqueta. Oh, that's a final. There's still danger here. What a block. A change on the offing for City. And over it comes. And did his job defensively. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester City facing Nottingham Forest. That's a good-looking shot. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Phillips, a routine save. Jared Bowen. Paqueta. Well, it could be on for him here. 
Routine for Edison. Gvardiol. Rodri. De Bruyne now. Walker. And snuffing out the danger. Well, we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. Pablo Fornals. Wasteful from City. Paqueta. Antonio. Electing to shoot and putting his body on the line. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Silva. De Bruyne now. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, they couldn't do anything positive with the cross. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Need to get back quickly here. A fine reading of the situation. Alvarez. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Fornals. Pablo Fornals. And fine goalkeeping. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And there's the delivery. And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, as I keep saying, if you make forward runs and you look to pass the ball forward and have players who can dribble past defenders, you're always going to carry a threat. And that's what they're doing at the moment. Their forward play was scintillating.